so from today we will start the new topic that is the biotechnology this topic biotechnology is somewhat we can say as advanced branch of biology biotechnology the name itself indicates what is mean by that biotechnology it is made up of two words bios and the technology bios means living organism technology means the use of that in different types of industrial uh, products so the use of living organisms or their products for in the technology is nothing but the biotechnology so in this chapter we will discuss first of all what is mean by that biotechnology what are the different aspects of biotechnology what are the different types of instruments what are the different types of processes which are included in the biotechnology so all these concepts we will clear in this topic biotechnology so here this biotechnology not only concerns with the living organisms broadly speaking we can say as this biotechnology is the application of different types of branches of science together for the production of different types of industrial or different types of uh, uses to the human beings or for the welfare of human beings biotechnology hi ashi branch hai ki jacha madhe javar javar science cha sagla shakha ekatrit माणसाच्या फायद्यासाठी वेगवेगळे प्रोडक्ट तयार करण्यासाठी वापरले जाते असं आपण ब्रॉडली असं म्हणू शकतो सो दॅट ब्रँच बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी वी हॅव टू डिस्कस इन दिस टॉपिक सो बिफोर ऍक्च्युली स्टार्टिंग द डिफरंट अस्पेक्ट रिगार्डिंग द बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल सी द डिफरंट टाइप्स ऑफ द ब्रँचेस ऑफ द सॉरी डिफरंट टाइप्स ऑफ डेफिनेशन ऑफ द बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी सो द फर्स्ट डेफिनेशन इट इज अ ब्रँच ऑफ बायोलॉजी विच डील्स विथ द टेक्निक्स of using living organisms enzymes or biological processes to develop products and provide services for human welfare as we have discussed earlier here all the different types of biological applications which are used for human welfare that is generally termed as the biotechnology so it may be the living organisms or the enzymes produced by the living organisms or different types of the biological processes by means of which the humans gets benefit so all the different types of biological aspects regarding the human welfare they are termed as the biotechnology second definition the development and utilization of biological forms products and processes for obtaining maximum benefits to man and other forms of life similar so here the utilization of biological forms products processes etc again for the benefit of the human beings again third definition it is the application of scientific and engineering principles to the processing of materials by biological agents to provide goods and services to the human welfare so this definition is somewhat advanced definition not only the biological processes or the scientific processes but also engineering principles are included in the biotechnology for the processing of the biological agents to provide goods and services for the human welfare so this is the third definition which we can say somewhat advanced definition of the biology where scientific knowledge and engineering principles both are used for completing different types of biological processes or biological agents to provide the goods and services for the human welfare so it is the scientific principles of microbiology genetic biochemistry chemical engineering mathematics statistics computer industrial processes etc so biotechnology is all together mixing of all the aspects of different types of scientific uh we can say scientific of the science branches the microbiology genetic biochemistry chemical engineering mathematics statistics computer industrial processes including the biology barobar ata ithe apan as directly as bahu lakshat gya ki ithe kay ki biological aspects tar vaparle japan parantu tyach barobar 
त्याच्यामध्ये मायक्रोबायोलॉजी ज्याला आपण मराठी सूक्ष्मजीवशास्त्र म्हणू शकतो जेनेटिक बायोकेमिस्ट्री आहे केमिकल इंजिनिअरिंग आहे मॅथमॅटिक्स आहे स्टॅटिस्टिक्स आहे कॉम्प्युटर आहे इंडस्ट्रीयल प्रोसेस आहेत ह्या सगळ्यांचा एकत्रित वापर करून माणसाच्या फायद्यासाठी तयार केले गेलेले प्रोडक्ट जे आहेत ते कशा साह्याने तयार केले जातात जे आपण ज्याला बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी असं त्या ठिकाणी म्हणू शकतो बायोलॉजिकल एजंट्स मीन्स प्लांट्स अॅनिमल सेल्स मायक्रो ऑर्गॅनिझम्स एन्झाईम्स ऑर देअर प्रोडक्ट्स कशाला म्हणायचं बायोलॉजिकल एजंट्स प्लांट सेल्स असतील अॅनिमल सेल्स असतील मायक्रो ऑर्गॅनिझम्स असतील त्यांच्यापासून तयार होणारे एन्झाईम्स असतील किंवा ह्या सगळ्यांपासून मिळणारे प्रोडक्ट्स असतील ऑल दीज आर इन्क्लुडेड इन द बायोलॉजिकल एजंट्स विथ द हेल्प ऑफ दीज बायोलॉजिकल एजंट्स अँड प्रिव्हियसली डिस्क्राईब डिफरंट टाईप्स ऑफ डिसिप्लिन ऑफ द सायन्स ऑल दीज टुगेदर प्रोड्यूस द गुड्स अँड सर्व्हिसेस विच आर बेनिफिशियल फॉर द ह्युमन बिंग्स दॅट इज नथिंग बट द बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी as far as the history of this biotechnology is concerned it is we can say as our four from our from uh, four fathers the use of biotechnology is carried out here the term which is used early from the old human civilization when human being is present or developed on this earth right from that uh, beginning of the human civilization the use of biotechnology is carried out the development of biological or the botanical um, biotechnology in terms of growth occurred in two phases <clears throat> as far as the growth of biotechnology this growth of biotechnology is carried out in two phases <clears throat> sorry because we have seen that the use of biotechnology is right from human civilization ya prithvi talavarti ja vels manasachi nirmiti jhali kiwa manus nirman jhala tyales pasun ya biotechnology cha vapar kela parantu hechi ji vaad ahe hechi ji growth ahe development ji jhali hi don phases madhe jhali traditional biotechnology and modern biotechnology first of all we will see what is mean by this traditional biotechnology it is primarily based on the fermentation technology using microorganisms as in the preparation of curd ghee samosa vinegar yogurt cheese making wine making etc so here the traditional biotechnology which is was used by our forefathers right from our human civilization here they does not known the importance of the biotechnology but still they carried out this process of biotechnology for which purpose production of uh, curd ghee vinegar yogurt cheese making wine making etc all these products are um, prepared right from our so human civilization our forefathers also carried out the preparation of all these products dudha pasun dahi tayar karne dahi pasun to tumcha doni ahe lonya pasun tup ahe vinegar ahe yogurt ahe cheese ahe wine making asel he far purvi pasun chalat ale त्यावेळेस त्यांना फक्त एकच माहित होते काही प्रकारचे प्रोसेस होते त्याला त्यांनाही हेही माहित नव्हते की त्याला आपण फर्मेंटेशन म्हणतात जरी इथं आपण म्हणले बेस्ड ऑन फर्मेंटेशन टेक्नॉलॉजी तरी सुद्धा त्या ठिकाणी त्या लोकांना व्हॉट इज मीन बाय फर्मेंटेशन दे डज नॉट नो बट स्टील दे कॅरीड आउट दिस प्रोसेस ऑफ बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी इट बिकम्स अन आर्ट किचन इन द इंडियन हाऊसेस ऍज फार ऍज इंडियन हाऊसेस आर कन्सर्न द यूज ऑफ बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी इज अ टाईप ऑफ आर्ट किचन एक कला होती कारण जेवढ्या वेगवेगळ्या प्रकारचे पदार्थ किचन मध्ये तयार केले जायचे तेवढं आपण ते जे आहे हाऊस वाईफ जे आहे त्याला असं म्हणत म्हणजे फार सुगरण ज्याला मराठीत शब्द वापरला कारण ते वेगवेगळे प्रकार तयार करायचे मग त्याच्यामध्ये ह्या सगळ्या गोष्टी आल्या मग त्याच्यामुळं त्यावेळेस पासून हे बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी जे आहे ते महत्वाचं आहे टील दॅट टाइम पीपल डिड नॉट नो ऍज टू हाऊ एक्झॅक्टली द प्रोसेस ऑकर्स and the organisms causing this process at that time they brings about the process all these processes are carried out by those human beings preparation of curd uh, ghee vinegar yogurt cheese uh, then wine making all these products are carried out by that human beings but they does not know the exact how this process takes place they only know that from the milk the curd can be prepared from the curd the um, we can say the ghee is prepared these processes are carried out by those uh, human being but they does not know how this process is carried out ajun hi aplya gramin bhagamade hi process mahit nahi samjha dudhamade aplya gramin bhagamade virjan takta barobar hai ti virjan ka taktat hyachat 
त्यांचं काही म्हणजे इंटरेस्ट नाही त्या गोष्टीमध्ये त्यांना ह्याच्याशी काही सुद्धा देणं घेणं नाही त्यांना काय माहीत दुधापासून दही तयार करत दही घुसळलं की त्याचं लोणी काढायचं लोण्यापासून त्याचं तूप निघणं एवढ्या गोष्टी आपल्याला माहित परंतु याच्यामध्ये कोणतेही बायोटेक्नॉलॉजिकल प्रोसेस आहे हे कोणालाही माहित तसंच त्या वेळेच्या लोकांना सुद्धा हे प्रोसेस त्या पद्धतीने त्यांना माहित नव्हती द कॉन्ट्रीब्युशन वॉज मेड बाय सेव्हरल वर्कर्स टू एक्सप्लेन द मेकॅनिझम ऑफ अ प्रोसेस अँड ऑल्सो द नेचर ऑफ मायक्रो ऑर्गनिझम कॉजिंग दिस प्रोसेस नाव हाऊ वेन द ह्युमन बिंग स्टार टू इवॉल्व द इंटेलिजन्स ऑफ द ह्युमन बिंग जेट्स इन्क्रीजेड सो क्युरियासिटी ऑफ द ह्युमन बिंग्स ह्युमन बिंग्स गेट इन्क्रीजेड सो दे बिकम्स क्युरियस हाऊ दिस कन्वर्शन ऑफ मिल्क कॅरीड आउट इन टू द कर्ड बाय ऍडिशन ऑफ सर्टन काइंड ऑफ प्रोडक्ट इन द मिल्क म्हणजे थोड काय म्हणू शकतो क्युरियासिटी जागरूक त्यांच्यामध्ये लक्षात यायला आलं की काय कशामुळे होत असेल बाबा हे की दुधामध्ये हे विरजन टाकतात विरजन टाकले की दही होतो दुधाचं मग त्या विरजनामध्ये काय असू शकते का म्हणजे हळूहळू जे आहे ही मेकॅनिकल प्रोसेस मेकॅनिझम जे आहे बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी प्रोसेस कशी होती काय होती याच्यावरती अभ्यास करायला चालू झाला आणि त्याच्यापासून मॉडर्न बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी गेट्स इव्हॉल्व ऑर मॉडर्न बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी गेट्स डेव्हलप इन नियर अबाउट नाईन्टीन हंड्रेड अँड सेवन्टी अ न्यू टेक्निक रिकॉम्बिनंट डीएनए टेक्नॉलॉजी वॉज डेव्हलप अँड दे देन एस्टॅब्लिश बाय स्टीहन कोहॅन अँड द हार्बर्ट वॉयर इन नाईन्टीन हंड्रेड अँड सेवन्टी थ्री नाव द डिस्कवरी रिगार्डिंग दिस बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी गेट्स इम्प्रूव्ह राईट फ्रॉम नाईन्टीन हंड्रेड अँड सेवन्टी वे आर द रिकॉम्बिनंट डीएनए टेक्नॉलॉजी वॉज डेव्हलप and these scientists cohen and boyer in 1973 they developed this recombinant dna technology ata ith je ahe abhyas jo ahe to kay te dudan takavarti maryadit rahla hai mansa ja gunasutra paryanta te tya thikane develop kala ani ha shastrajna ne tyachavarti jast research kela ani halu halu ji ahe modern biotechnology ji ahe te develop kala chalna the combination of biology production of technology based on genetic engineering evolved into the modern biotechnology atta parincha je kai human civilization ate na phakte ha baki cha kirkul processes mahit hote dud tayar karna dahi tayar karna loni tayar karna cheese butter etc etc it parant tas janna mahit hote parantu ata je ahe ja vela recombinant dna technology tayar jhali tacha madhe combination of biology and the production of technology कारण टेक्नॉलॉजी ही इव्हॉल्व होत गेली आणि ह्या दोन ब्रँचेस जसजशा इव्हॉल्व होत गेल्या तस तसं मॉडर्न बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी आहे ती डेव्हलप व्हायला चालू झालं द न्यू डेफिनेशन ऑफ मॉडर्न बायोलॉजी वॉज गिव्हन बाय ई एफ बी वॉट इज मीन बाय ई एफ बी द युरोपियन फेडरेशन ऑफ बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी इन शॉर्ट इट इज न टर्म ऍज ई एफ बी दॅट युरोपियन फेडरेशन ऑफ बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी डिफाईन द बायोटेक्नॉलॉजी इन अ न्यू वे it is the integration of natural science and organism cells parts thereof and molecular analogs of for the products and the services ata ithe suruvatila tra asa manaycha biotechnology in art and science doni hoti kala pan hoti tacha pan ata te je hai this biotechnology is integration of natural sciences all the different types of branches which are related or which are useful for the production of different types of goods and services for the welfare of human beings they are the natural sciences and organisms or their cells or parts of parts thereof and molecular analogs for the product of services parat tita sat me whatever the discoveries are taken place they are only for the human benefit but here in biotechnology the application of different types of sciences including the different types of living organisms or their cells or their products and molecular analogs that is the different types of molecular processes taken out in the body of that living organisms all these together are used for the production of the different types of products and services there are two major features of technology that differentiate modern biotechnology from old biotechnology so what is the difference between the traditional biotechnology and the modern biotechnology here the term, uh, word which is usually the old biotechnology there are two major features the first one is the capability of science to change the genetic material for getting 
new specific product through recombinant DNA technology. Polymer is a chain reaction, microarrays, cell culture and fusion and bioprocessing. These different types of aspects are not known in the old biotechnology. In advanced biotechnology, what we call it as a modern biotechnology, all these aspects are developed. Our DNA means recombinant DNA technology. We will see what is meant by that recombinant technology, what is meant by polymerase chain reaction, etc. We will see in these different types of aspects in the uh, next points. What is meant by our DNA technology, polymerase chain reaction, culture, cell culture. So we will see one by one. So that is the first difference between the modern and the old biotechnology. Second, ownership of technology and its socio-political impact. When this biotechnology is developed in the modern biotechnology, the ownership of different types of products are there. What is termed as a biopatent? We will see again that what uh, ownership in uh, in the uh, remaining points. And that's for over socio-political impacts. Samaja madhe ya gushti sa kai parinam hoto ka. Hya sagalaya ja gushti aahe tya dunya kaala madhe bhagit liya jat na hoda. Hya dono gushti varthi apan modern and old biotechnology hya differentiate karo shakta. So this is the first few um, introductory part regarding the biotechnology. In the next lecture we will discuss about how this biotechnology or we can say the modern biotechnology is developed. What are the different types of tools which are used to develop the biotechnology?